Today is United Nations Volunteer Day and I want on behalf of Ayuga to thank all of our volunteers, you, for all the incredible work that you do on behalf of the organisation. We couldn't possibly achieve our mission of advancing education and patient care without the incredible work of our volunteers. If you think about it, if you look at the committees that you work on, the special interest groups, the IUJ editors who do a huge amount of work in their own time. We've also got you reviewing papers for the journal, abstracts for the scientific meeting. We have people organising the scientific meeting and the regional symposium. So many things that all of you get involved in. And I'm sorry if I've missed out anybody, but there are a huge number of volunteers working for IUGA. Now why do we do all this? Well, it's because IUGA is a very special society for all of us and we have it dear in our hearts and we want to see it move onwards and upwards and become the premier urogynecological association that it is. Um, now I know how difficult it is to be a volunteer through personal experience. Um, we all put a huge amount of time and effort in. We come home after a busy day at work and then we get down to doing a yoga business and that is a personal sacrifice and a lot of commitment and the sacrifice is often the family and friends. And so I want to pay a very special debt of gratitude to the families who support us in our work, give us the time and are tolerant of us doing this. So to them, thank you very much indeed on behalf of Ayuga. We seem to have turned the corner financially and that is no small measure due to the hard work, not just of the paid staff, but the volunteers. And I'd like to pay particular thanks to my colleagues on the board who have worked so hard over the last 18 months to turn Ayuga around and for that I say thank you very much indeed to all my colleagues on the board. Over the next few years we're going to need more help from all of you, from our volunteers, to move Ayuga forward. We can't rest in our laurels as we would say at this moment in time. We can't be complacent, we have to continue that hard work and I believe if we do that we're going to be an extremely successful society. So do keep up the hard work. Thank you so much for all you do on behalf of Ayuga. And I look forward to seeing you in Cape Town.